Did you know that your passwords are probably out there? This is a fantastic website, Have I Been Pwned? It shows us that almost 15 billion accounts have been pwned. Usernames and passwords have been leaked, for instance, on the dark web. Hackers have breached the security of companies such as Facebook and leaked the credentials of 500 million accounts. This is happening all the time. Here is a list of the largest breaches. Here are recent breaches. Samsung Germany, SpyX, millions and millions of accounts have been compromised and passwords are leaked out there. That means that you shouldn't be using the same password across many accounts. You can do a test, put in your email here. So I'll just say test at test.com and see if that account has been pwned. And you can see, yep, this account has been pwned. This happened in 564 data breaches and 1,433 pastes. Breaches that you were pwned in, Adobe, Yahoo, etc., etc., Forbes and so forth. So you can put in your own email address into have I been pwned and see if your passwords have been compromised. A lot of people pay for companies to tell them that their passwords have been compromised and those companies often use the data that's stored in have I been pwned. Troy Hunt, the creator of this website, is very well known in the cybersecurity space. He is well respected, has created this website to help make the world a better place. He recommends that you use one password as an example to generate secure, unique passwords for every account. I'm not sponsored by one password, but as you can see, Troy, very respected individual, recommends that you use one password, create individual passwords for every website so that if a password so it does get compromised, it doesn't affect other websites as well. Hackers will use this kind of data to see if you're using the same password across multiple websites. And if you are, they can access not just one account, but many accounts that you have. So best practice is use a password for every website. Use a password manager like 1Password to help you do that. Don't use the same password across multiple websites.